Odia guests, I would like to welcome you in our laboratory here today in New York. Thank you very, very much for coming. Let me introduce myself I am the senior scientist of Ukrainian Fashion Research Laboratory. And uh, I would like to talk you through about our laboratory and about our experiment. Uh, the name of our experiment is the Experiment 01. And actually, I hope that I will explain you just a little bit so it makes you easy to navigate by yourself and will give you essential details to understand what is happening here today. Uh, experiment number 01 is actually the presentation of Ukrainian designers, certain Ukrainian designers and objects, certain objects. Those objects are the garments, the garments from their latest collections. But uh, most of us are actually uh, consuming fashion. And here in this laboratory, we are researching fashion. Actually, we are researching how uh, it's manifesting. So from the brains of our Ukrainian designers, something beautiful appears. Have anybody heard about the phenomena that call Pareodolia. So this is a psychological phenomenon of recognizing uh, patterns, shapes, and even familiar objects in a very vague and very random stimulus. And those stimulus are affecting how we are perceiving the reality. And through this phenomena, we are exploring the creativity, the self-identification, the self-perception, the creative, the creativity with the dynamic uh, world, with the dynamic surrounding. So um, the main subjects of our experiments, of our study, are six individuals. And those individuals are Bokova, Fralov, Jews, Ruslan Baginski, uh, called by Katya Silchenka and Elizaveta Balasovska. Entire set here, along with the crafted design, arch archival files, visual sounds, and virtual reality, uh, illustrate the active dialogue and interaction of inner world of designers with the surroundings. In this experiment, we examine chaotic, abstract, and um, diverse cloud of meanings, science, and plethora of reinterpretations that shapes one's identity. We look what and how affect uh, us, the moments um, that shape our nowness the moments that affect our feelings. What is actually self-identification? How do you perceive it? How do you communicate it? And how is our reality being shaped? And how are we affected by it? So try to explore this random stimulus and see uh, what what your feeling would be, and then try to imagine how our designers reinterpret those random stimulus. And then uh, you can share with us your feelings, your emotions. But if you would need any additional assistance, please feel free to ask. And also you have those explanations near each installation where you can read a little bit more. And if you have a certain instructions, how you can actually interact with the objects that are in our lab today. Thank you very much for your attention, and if you have any questions, please feel free to ask. And really, I am very, very grateful that you take the time from your busy schedule today on Monday and came and uh, spent this time with us in our laboratory. Thank you very, very much.